your Mammogram Minute. A health and wellness resource presented by the Breast Imaging Specialists at EWBC. MRI is magnetic resonance imaging, and there's no radiation involved. It's similar to a CAT scan, because you go into a tube. The difference usually between a CAT scan and an MRI is, one, no radiation, and two, you're laying on your stomach, and you're laying on coils that are called breast coils, and they help us produce an image of each breast. It helps us identify abnormalities in your breast that may be hiding in dense breast tissue and helps us evaluate you further. It does require a contrast injection. So we will start an IV and inject a small amount of contrast prior to your MRI examination. If we diagnosed you with a breast cancer, it's become the standard of care to do an MRI prior to surgery especially in young women and in women with dense breasts, MRI may identify a second area of cancer that was not seen on the mammogram or ultrasound or the initial evaluation. So MRI is very important. So a patient that has had breast cancer themselves, has a precancerous lesion, is a, a BRCA1 or 2 genetic mutation patient, or has other risk factors, those are the patients that should be considering MRI and should be communicating with their gynecologist or internist to see if MRI is a reasonable additional screening test for them. Our breast radiologists here at Elizabeth Wendy Breast Care are very well versed to MRI and the indications and the appropriateness criteria. So also our patients are welcome to speak with one of our radiologists. To learn more about this and other breast health topics, please visit our website at ewbc.com.